like for you in the modeling industry? What does that look like for you? Like everybody has a different, you know, outlook on what success look like for you. What does that look like? Um, success for me is being is being happy and making sure like my client is happy um, with you know the photos and and what they want and it's just establishing relationships. Um, that's success for me. Like I'm not signed to any agency. Like I don't have no manager or anything like that. I get my own bookings. Um, I am working right now currently with a team filthy model oh, yeah, uh, yeah. under the direction under the direction of Filthy Rich. Um, so explain that. Kendall. Explain that because I know I saw I saw you post that. Of course, I saw it on social media. I saw you post that, that you was working with Filthy Rich, the, uh, the rapper from the Bay. He's from the Bay Area, but I don't know what city, but I know he's from the Bay Area exactly. I know exactly what city. From Oakland. From okay, Oakland. yeah. And uh, as far as, like, how does that work? Like, for explain it to, like, uh, someone who doesn't know, like myself or some model or looking to get an industry. How does that work when working with an agency? Do they find your bookings for you? Do they get, the, do they get all the photographers? Like, how does that whole... Uh, thing work well I've always been independent so I've always been proactive and to you know reaching out and submitting for castings by myself mm -hmm. and you know I've been representing myself um so as far as working with uh team filthy it's more of, it's a collaborative effort you know what I'm saying because he is a rapper he is an artist so that's it. His main focus mm -hmm. is the music. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, he hit me up and asked me if I wanted to be a part of it. And, you know, we've done calendars. We've done, you know, club uh, promos. So um, we've taken a break, pandemic, you know, since yeah. the pandemic. It's understandable. It's kind of off everything. So right now he's focused on the label uh, Funk or Die, E N T. Nice. So he's doing that and, you know, pumping out new artists. Definitely. So if he, if you, and when you work with an agency, if you decide to book something outside of the team Filthy, do you have to pay them a percentage back or something like that? Or was it all, you get to keep all the revenue yourself? No, you know what I'm saying? I, I, he, if he uh, books us, like when he books us a party, he, he sets okay. the price, um, you know what I mean? on his back end because he got to yep, get his sure. money too and and so he sets the price on what each of us get at the end of the night and I can say it's been you know what I'm saying it's been pretty good we've been making money together that's dope. so that's I've been dope. happy that's dope that's dope man <laughs> so and do you but I had to like worry about like if I get my own booking outside of uh, Team Filthy like you know he, they supportive like they don't it's not nothing like where i'm like mm -hmm. signed or you know locked in contract I, you know i'm just an ambassador or representative nice. so. so are you actively like looking for for bookings and things like that or you just kind of do it when you feel like it i've pretty much been doing it what i feel like it you know what i'm saying some photographers will hit me up you know what i'm saying like um kevin uh allen um Eric, oh yeah, the mm -hmm. jerk. He's a so he hooked me up um with a job and he got me on the back of the square pie pizza. Okay, truck. nice. So that drives around the Bay That's Area. I'm on, I'm on the back of that. So you know he hit me up for that. You know that got me paid for that. So hey, that's kind of, hey, get money. You, like I said it's all about yeah. relationships. So you know. What I'm like, you know, I've been knowing Filthy for years, um, for, oh, geez, pretty much over 10 years. So, you know what I'm saying? He hit me up. It was, that was nothing, you know what I'm saying, to join his team and collab with him. And, you know, I've been knowing um, Irk the Jerk, so, and he got into his photography, and I shot with him in the beginning stages of his photography, so... It's all about establishing relationships. You know, I got relationships with the designers, photographers. You know, it's all about. Absolutely. 